Hello, Todd Bog here with Breaking the Stream, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Conquest of Elysium V, the Baron playthrough. Uh, where we last left off, we had uh, basically pushed into the enemy territory here, um, and we managed to take uh, both uh, of the citadels from the Demonologist. I don't expect them to have much left, and as a matter of fact, we see an army here, so I think we're going to actually attack it. We're going to take some losses, unfortunately. But I think it'll be worth the effort because uh, I think that might be one of his last, if not the last, uh, territory he has, or army he has. So in the meanwhile, my other armies need to go out and do their things. Uh, let's see. Oravade, let's go ahead and drain the swamp. All right, over here. So the question is, do I bring all the trebuchets and everything with? I don't think we need to at this point. We're going to take those off here. And um, we're just going to basically go out and we're going to hunt for armies with them. Uh, let's see. we got a nice decent sized army here. Just take that. Start getting our armies in the right direction here, right? And of course, uh, so that was three soulless. So they must uh, the overrun mechanic got three t that time. So that's interesting. Um, hmm. well, let's murder the crack in here. And we're just coming here to do that. Let's see. Yep. I was hoping to kill these guys, but I guess spirits had uh, other things to say, huh? Um, yep, you guys are done. Oh, nope, don't want to burn a forest right now with you. Uh, let's see, we do have a lot of gold, so we should probably utilize that. Um, we'll get that. We'll also grab the ten spearmen here. You can... Oh, shouldn't have been at the castle. Guess we'll go here. We'll visit the library. And perform that ritual of mastery. Uh, not a fan of seeing giant ant queens all over the place, but you know. When in doubt. Alright, over here, let's go ahead and grab some longbowmen. Just to put something on the wall with regular attacks. And we'll go ahead and end our turn here. Alright, so let's. Uh, so we did. Uh, win, uh, so kind of a spoiler there. Murgles, I didn't even see that. That was their name. All right, let's view the battle here. So things I expect: this unicorn knight's going to do wonderful um, with the high armor, the huge amount of hit points, the ring of protection, and the bloodstone ring. I think we're going to do wonderful things there. Uh, otherwise, I expect that um, we're just going to lose some troops to spell casting, mainly. So. Got about the uh, air elemental we get. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at all that stun. I forget, magic resistance of eight is really good. All right. So we did pretty good overall. Uh, overall, we only lost six troops, and uh, we eliminated another one of our opponents. Uh, we killed... Oh, I didn't know there were two Krakens there, but we killed them. Uh, and then ambushed in a farm. Uh, we lost our captain, unfortunately. Um, but we did manage to defeat them. Okay. Well, that sucks. All right. Where was that farm at, huh? Oh, is it up here? So there we go, we got ourselves a nice large army. Oop, that's not a recruit spot. Uh, we'll grab the scouts, pikeneers, and longbow here, and eventually we'll send them out. Oh, of course, there's more spirits. Always fun. All right. Uh, let's see, what else can we do? So we don't have any leaders. All right, well, you guys are gonna get moving, right? Got to get to that ancient forest, which is controlled by the centipedes, which I thought was going to happen. Uh, over here, we're going to explore. And I guess we'll take over the 
Troll King's stuff here. Uh, we got an old castle ruins. Uh, they do have some archers on the walls and stuff. Not going to be able to withstand that, though. Hmm. Yeah, let's take that. That's Oh, and we got old Mum here. Uh, she doesn't have much of a force, so we'll be able to crush her as well. Or maybe the ants will. That'd be great. Um, over here, let's see. Yeah, we're just marching forward with this force. Definitely needs more archers, but... Um, do we have something slow, or no? We just lost it because of the... Uh, move on to the coal mine. Alright, I guess we'll take care of those spirits later. Now, let's go ahead and do that again. We once again have control, and we have to come down and knock out the serpent, and I think we'll have uh, pretty good control overall. So what do you got? Do you have decent sets of archers and such? So let's go ahead and grab ourselves a couple more longbowmen. Uh, let's see. Yep. That looks good to me. And I guess we'll kill even more spirits. <laughs> At least we're getting close to the end of that, right? So... All right, I should kill these ghost warriors. Let's do that. Maybe, oh, it's a broken portal, so we can't get in there anyways, so. All right, Oberic, you definitely don't want to battle a giant ant queen, and so we'll uh, have to figure that out, I guess, later. Uh, King's Pride, let's go ahead and buy ourselves some longbow. I mean, two trebuchets. Oh, not enough iron. We are officially out of iron. Okay. Uh, so let's... I don't need the gold anymore, so let's not sell iron. Let's actually go back to buying iron for now. Um, get us back up on our list here. Okay. I need to eliminate that. All right. Old Castle Ruins. Yeah, we murdered them. That wasn't uh, much of a fight. Dispossessed Spirits. Black Portal. There was a wraith on there, so we managed to kill it. Uh, Unicorn Knight killed all of it, so that's good. Uh, and we found a magic item. Let's see. Go to. Okay, yeah, on the portal. Okay, we got a magic item out of that. That's cool. Amulet of Cold Resistance. Uh, and he found a coral ring. Okay, well, go you. Uh, you now have Pierce Resistance and uh, Cold Resistance, so... That's awesome. All right, two archers and four longbow. You need archers of all sorts, so let's go ahead and recruit longbowmen. Snag all of those. Uh, we'll do uh, some more longbow here and longbow here. Okay, and you can pick them up as you go, perfect. Over here, oh, did we run out of iron? Is that what happened? Okay, uh, use your special powers, repeat, greater alchemy. Use your special powers, repeat, greater alchemy. Okay, that's good. All right, so we're in a good spot here. Can I do anything special here? Let's see, use your special powers. No, still haven't found the king's castle, by the way. Um, we did get these boots with the extra movement points, so that might be useful. So let's see. Can't raise levies or anything. We can do a recruit. And uh, we should probably f flush out that melee line a bit, huh? Um, some swordsmen. Just get a few more people between us. I think we're going to go murder the old mum here, so let's do that. We got ants all over, but uh, they're not too concerning. Let's see. Just regular forest. Okay. Cern Let's see. That's regular dead forest, so might as well do that to take that over. And then, uh, yeah, we just have to dance around the ants and find the rest of the Troll King stuff. At this point, coronation really isn't going to mean much for us. Ah, I should have got that ancient forest. I got confused. Um, just because... At this point, there's only one opponent left, right? And uh, I think they're in this corner of the map, so we'll eventually find them. But we'll see. I mean, if we can make it work, we'll make it work. But um, it is unfortunate, so we may have to revisit the uh, Baron class at some point in the future. 
and see what it's like to be a king. Um, just go this way. All right, you come in here. You're gonna use your special powers for greater alchemy. Should put that on repeat, but we'll deal with that later. All right, battle in giant ant hill. So we lost two spearmen and two swordsmen. Let's see what happened though. All right, so she's got summon pack of wolves, one to sixteen wolves. That's pretty good. Dread monster, so one to eight fear uh, against burst one hundred. Now what's making that less effective is my leadership of two. So morale for him is nine. Morale for my standard guys are eight. So it has to roll a max roll to make some of my guys run. Um, now these guys aren't nearly as good, but uh, that's to be expected. So that's going to do some damage, but not a lot. Terror is another fear. Plague sucks. I hate that she can plague, but we'll uh, we'll just have to. Uh, So she did plague, right? Is that what she ended up casting? Nope. She cast terror. Good. Good, 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 good. Uh, more terror. As you can see, we got some people running despite their high morale because she did roll a lot. But She is getting those uh, lucky rolls. So, Alright. So overall, we did fairly well there. So... Um, and then we've got some recruits that we can do here. Okay, perfect. Um, what do we need? Pike and ears. And we can grab the archers there too. And there we go. We're ref refitted and ready to go. Um, okay, cool. There's some doggies. There's that meteor. Okay. So we're just basically... Oh! <laughs> There you go. There's the king's castle. All right. So for those of you who haven't seen, king uh, has a ritual. He's a ritual caster. Interesting. I wonder if that's because we turn into him. I don't know. Anyways, they have a golden wizard with silver armor, which is just awesome. That is really cool. I like that. Uh, I don't like it on him. I wish they gave it to someone else, but, you know. Um, we got a hero here with the eye of the old one, which causes them to get regeneration. Ooh, I'm glad the troll didn't get that. We got rainbow armor, which gives lucky and armor too. That's fantastic. Uh, yeah, and these guys can be problematic. Usually when I run against the king, I don't have human troops, but those guys can convert them. So we're going to have to bring a decent-sized army against them. I think this will work just fine, though. This will work just fine. What's that do? Fire resistance... Uh, I mean, let's give it to this guy, right? Because now with the pelt, he's got pierce and slash resistance, etherealness. It's just, he's, he's great. He is great. All right. Let's see. I mean, you guys can take out the earth elemental, but the pit doesn't do anything for us. No reason to... No, we'll, we'll take the ancient forest back just because... Uh, we'll have it under our control so it won't spawn monsters, one. And two, um, you know, it is it is a possible spawn point for our uh, friend, the uh, Troll King. So we got to make sure we take those out if we want to eliminate him thoroughly. All right, so first we come up here. We recruit more Longbow. Oops. Transfer all. We'll leave the... Uh, Halberdiers. We'll get more longbow here. Transfer up those guys. All right. Now we got ourselves a pretty, pretty solid army. I can be happy with that. Uh, over here, you're going to use your special powers on repeat. Uh, so we're getting gold galore. Uh, let's see if it shows all the different things. It does not. Okay. Oh, yeah, you gotta... I think it escaped. Okay. Yeah, some of those can't scroll, or uh, maybe I'm missing where you're supposed to click to scroll. And if you can't click exit, you can hit escape to get out of it. So, Giant Ant Queen's dead. Battle in the Plains is good. And Battle in the Hamlet. The Spirits killed my levies. So, they're still out there. 
Uh, do I go and get coronated? Um, yeah, might as well. Let's work our way over. Uh, this army should be able to take them out. Oh, good. We need to take out this army anyways. So, all works out. Grab that. They already summoned some bears, but, you know. There. Hey, the serpents came up to us. They, they were trying to take over our stuff. Everybody wants that silver mine, apparently, so. Alright. No real great way to go, otherwise I'll choose it. So, let's go ahead and grab... Mm, let's get the longbow in there. Um... I'm waiting for somebody to get a leader here, but I'll just grab those guys, I guess, and you'll have a ready-made army there. Uh, what are we doing? We're just going to go here, because it really isn't a better spot. Alright, let's view the battle in the King's Castle. So, First of all, mirror image is just amazing. Solar Flare uh, and Sleep. Okay, we got off easy. The Solar Flare is going to hurt, but... Uh, you do not have... What I'm worried about with these guys is conversion. Ooh, saving grace, twist fate, and resist magic. So none of that either. So we got lucky with their spell casting, so... Magic resistance is only six. All right, so that took a while, but overall, I didn't even see them kill that many people. We lost 54 troops. Jeez. Um, crossbowmen, longbowmen, pikeneer, swordsmen, archers, and spearmen. We also lost a high lord, um, but we managed to kill them. Spoils of war. Got 60 gold and uh, all that wonderful armor. Amazing. Um, Battle in the Mountains. That was some serpents. Nice and easy. So we got a captain finally. And a star sapphire can be purchased. Okay. So you guys can just move here. Alright. So the captain was going to come up here. Trash the captain. Alright. And what else do you want? You probably want some longbow because... You've got melee troops galore. Yep. Alright, so we'll murder those guys and get them cleared out. And then we'll come up and pick those guys up. Over here, we'll kill the bear. Alright. So, transfer. We need melee. That's what we really need. We lost a lot of melee. So we'll get the ten spearmen. We'll get the star sapphire on our court mage and see what that looks like. Um, magic resist minus one boosts void magic and lucky interesting so it's an interesting mix for sure all right we have the king's castle i'm not worried about anything that can take it here we need to go and eliminate the trolls so we'll do that and then we'll see where we end up all right you can take that for now the apocalypse is real in the troll lands all right you're just going to move there. Move up. And we'll uh, attack in a two-pronged assault here. So, All right. All right, that was the troll. All right, battle in the plains. Fire ants we killed. Deer bear we killed. Dispossessed spirits. And we killed fire ants. Nice and easy. All right. Gauntlets of Power. Okay. Well, uh, you guys can't do anything else but murder that. We'll go ahead and come in here. Uh, we'll grab... I was supposed to grab those spearmen, but we'll grab these guys, these guys. Alchemists. We'll give the alchemist the Gauntlets of Power. And throw some longbow up. Why not? Let's see, visit library, we'll perform a ritual of mastery. It's still a level one library, right? Yeah, okay. Is what it is. Well, let's go ahead and uh, use our special powers for greater alchemy. Oh, we're, we're out, duh. Okay. 
All right, at this point, we're just gonna continue moving over. Um, well, I'm not gonna keep this for very long, but we might as well murder some ants while we're here. He'll come and take this uh, iron mine back, and I think the Tatsu just keeps coming closer and closer to us. Um, this army here is probably going to have to hunt down the ants some more. Let's grab some longbow here. Transfer. I'll grab all of them. And, uh, Trast is going to come up and grab stuff there. Okay. And we should be done with winter, which will be nice. Yeah. Battle in a port. Uh, so we killed all of them. There really wasn't much to see there. Giant Ant Hill done and Giant Ant Hill lost two spearmen done. Okay. Boots of the Mountain. So they're just giving us magic items like crazy. Um, what do we got? Oh, we got 11 cities. That's why and three temples. So yeah. Um, all right. Well, let's move there. Let's go ahead and use our special power. Coronation. Now we're a king. All right. So as king, we have our scepter, so we become less fighty. Uh, we're stealthy, though. Uh, wait. The king protects the nobles against brigands, beasts, and other kinds of evil. For this protection, the king charges quite a hefty fee, as this protection is hard to provide in a place like Elysium. The king's knights and soldiers are not always strong enough to beat the evil forces that roam Elysium, but they're certainly strong enough to beat down any noble who refuses to pay. So, interesting. We can raise castles. Oh. Wow. You turn a farm into a castle. That is pretty sweet. Uh, speaking of which, he's going to probably want to do the relocate manor. Um, I guess we can do that now. So we're just going to now get our recruits here. So we're going to get a brand new army, which is fantastic. Um, but yeah, so he could just build straight up castles. Uh, that's, that's really cool. Um, nothing else really to do here. I'm curious if towers now will spawn troops like it did for the old king, but that's cool. So we did become king, for what it's worth. Um, one thing I didn't mention is that the king's castle also is very important. If you ever have a chance to take one, take it in any of your games, because all your gold income is increased by 25%. So right now, does that stack? And I can't tell you, because it won't let me scroll. We got too many things, but um, let's see. Yeah, there's no way to say, um, but yeah, I believe it stacks. So I should be getting even more gold than, than I'm currently getting, which is just insane when you think about it. All right, so to port, let's go ahead and grab, um, you guys really don't need more archers and crossbow, but oh, I don't have the gold anyways. I spent it all on my thing. Oh, well. So be it. All right, you guys will murder ants because that's all you can do. Uh, you still got an action point left. Oh, we don't want Nadejo. What we do want is to transfer. Hit that wonderful I button. Um, you don't need the gauntlet of power for plus two strength, so let's give that to... Why not? He now hits for just ridiculous amounts of damage. Um... I mean, he's already got a better helmet. Does he? He doesn't need this spirit eye. He can't take it anyways. So, yeah, no, we're we're in good shape. Let's uh just hit that transfer. We'll get all of our troops here. Um, I mean, we only got one action point anyway, so let's just do that. And you guys can get the arch. Oh, I don't have the gold. I keep thinking I have gold. All right. Just moving over. Uh, you should be using your special power. Repeat. I should probably do the same thing at least one more time, right? That way we get up above the 50 gold mark. And we can go ahead and buy ourselves... We'll just do the... 
I could do more, but honestly, I don't need more than the longbowmen here at this point, so. All right, uh, you, sir, go ahead and murder that. All right, there is an army here. This can be problematic because of the caster, um, but that is a pretty strong army, so I don't feel like we're going to be in trouble there for sure. Um, go ahead and murder you for now. And then you, sir, just coming up there. And that should be everybody. Yeah, they're running away, as expected. All right, so we lost some troops to ants. Uh, we killed them. We killed the queen. And we lost a knight to some carrion. So not bad. All right. Might as well do that. Okay, that was a good move. All right, here, let's transfer up. This well-protected farm is now got some decent troops going for it. Steal a market village there. Um, all right, let's just do that. Uh, let's chase after our friend. Oh, they got a ta guard tower, so a flame tower. Huh? Interesting. Interesting name for it. And there's still spirits around there, so. Alright, we killed the ants. Let's go this way. Oh! As a matter of fact, that'll be cool. I can upgrade both of those wizards once I get the gold for it. Uh, we'll just take their iron. That's a big old group of dwarves for an iron mine, so. Yep, you're gonna try and run away. Okay. So, battle, giant ant queen, uh, more losses due to ants, and then dispossessed spirits. Okay. So, we know they got a leader over here, so we're going to worry about that. But first, let's go ahead and give Hintal. So, as you can see, he's level two. Oh, he's level two already, though. So, if I visit the library, I won't be able to form to level three. But she can visit the library. So, this is interesting. She is a uh, frostman. Oh, no, she's a level two as well. I was thinking she was the ice druid, but she's not. So they're both level two. They're both in great shape. So we don't need to do anything but uh, move out. Take that. All right. This army is pretty solid. Do that. You guys will have to crush this army here. They did get another recruit out, but that's fine. They took Aeol, as they usually do. Oh, uh, grab some longbow for this army. Um, that's a lot of regular archers. We'll leave two to actually defend it, and we'll see what happens there. These are all hills. That is just atrocious terrain. All right. Uh, I probably should. Oh, uh, yeah, no, that's fine. Archery and my guy will take care of it. Poison cloud, silly thing. All right, we do have another leader here, which we can eliminate, and that'll be good too. All right, just continue exploring. All right, I have a feeling we're very close to winning here, so. Uh, conscripted, bunch of people, bunch of things. Uh, we got the carrion stalkers. Oh, that's the one we wanna see. So. so these guys hit fairly hard. Um, we'll see what happens. Let's see. And he's stronger. So, okay. And this is where they do their damage back, which hurts. Uh, enchanted Sleep and Plague. So that sucks. But he's casting Strength a bunch right now. So, And there goes the Plague. So... They're gonna die slow deaths, but it's all right. We got them all. Okay, so battle in the plains. We ended up losing 27 troops, mostly spearmen. Uh, eight knights, though. That was uh, pretty hard hitting, um, but we managed to eliminate them, so that's good. Troll forest. We lost a unicorn knight. Oh no, we lost our unicorn knight. Because of decay. Mm. Stupid decay. 
Oh, he was doing so great, too. Okay. All right, well, let's see. We can do this. That's our troll pit. They don't seem to have a leader. So I'm going to attack this. And, oh, that's a lot of decay. No, that's poison. These are the decay. Eh, okay. Well, we'll attack this. Hopefully eliminating that will uh, win us the game. And we can see what our end result is. Uh, hopefully that stays frozen. Because I was not checking my movement. Alright. Let's see. Kill that, I guess. I was supposed to take the tower just in case, but... Eh, what are you gonna do? Um... Take that and kill the ants. Keep moving. And we were ambushed. That'll be some troll king shenanigans. All right, over here, let's see. We can recruit ourselves a court mage. Um, well, we got a lot of gold, so let's just grab all of that. Um, we'll grab some longbowmen and the high lord. Why not? All right, so Celerim, what'd you start with? Uh, that wonderful star sapphire. All right, so we'll grab this entire army that we just made appear out of nowhere. Uh, so that's cool. Um, we'll just murder ants. I don't think we'll be able to do much else. So let's see if we win. And we win! That's what I thought. Okay. So Hamlet, uh, pretty easy. The troll forest. Oh, let me just watch everything die. Yeah, enchanted sleep, plague. Um, so yeah, those... If you can get them up to Goblin Witch Doctors, that's pretty good. I mean, Curse and Summon Wolf, not so great. Um, but Enchanted Sleep, it's huge. Now, Plague can be annoying, too. Uh, and the reason why that's important is that the Plague reduces your strength. So when your troops are plagued, um, lowered strength means that he's doing less damage. So now he's doing one less damage. It means your trolls are even more powerful because their armor is still there. Now you see this troll is taking all the things. Still only has, uh, still has an eye though, so. But yeah. So we managed to do that. Battle in a farm, yeah, it doesn't matter. The rest of them are done like that. Yeah, there's no fight, so. So overall, that was uh, that was the battle with the Baron. You got to see me get kingship at the very last minute um, for what that's worth. But you got to see what that does. Being able to found castles anywhere, fantastic. Takes resources and it takes three months to build, uh, which coincidentally I think is the length of time it takes to build your smaller forts in Dominion. So kind of a neat thing. But um, being able to found that castle and then drop all those free troops that you get each year in the area that you need it most is huge so uh and obviously the castles give you gold as well but probably won't pay itself back uh before long so more importantly i think if you found it on an island that would give you a lot more protection against a lot of armies too so uh so in a multiplayer game you definitely don't want the baron to get the castle um but 600 gold it may not be uh something that can be abused easily by the time they can take advantage of it fully, I guess they'll probably already have a large advantage over you. So, anyways, uh, let's go ahead and reveal the map. Um, so, as you can see, Antpocalypse was well on its way over here in this corner of the map. Uh, we did a pretty good job stamping it down here because you can see the ants were going uh, to town there. And it looks like they were self powered. In other words, uh, it wasn't a Scourge Lord, so uh, they didn't get that ball rolling. So, it looks like. Uh, they did a pretty good job of just festering over here. Um, really does suck that the castle was all the way over there when we started all the way over here. So literally as far away from us as it could be. But, um, you know, it's pretty good, though, that we got the kingship. So we got to at least show that off. Um, yeah, nothing really crazy in terms of things. You got a port here. Uh, was that another castle? Yep, another castle here. Um, and some gems. Let's see. 
some more tatsu yeah overall i think uh we did a pretty good job we saw most of the map looks like they had another ancient forest up here i'm guessing was controlled by the troll king so we would have had to take that and then this troll pit and then we would have probably had one so um i'm guessing the troll king uh was definitely hurt by all the ants roaming around because it kept retaking their forest so they couldn't use it to their uh, best effect so so that was definitely a boon for us in that regard but um yeah overall uh pretty interesting map i i have to say uh pretty standard landmass but the center here uh, was where the uh was it the hoburger no with a graveyard nearby yeah, no, I think it was just a standard Hoburger. I can't remember now. I will find out in the graphs, but they started here right dead center, which is rough, uh, usually. Uh, but there's some def definite interesting uh, landmarks nearby. Uh, let's see. Yeah, so so that was that. Uh, let's go ahead and view the score graphs. Uh, so just to verify, we had ourselves, Kobold King, Demonologist, Cloud Lord, Dryad Queen, Mark Graph. It was a Mark Graph. And a Troll King, so... Um, yep, no, uh, no Scourge Lord. So. so as you can see, in terms of power, Baron being the Baron, um, you can stay on top of the power graph uh, just because you get those free troops. And those free troops uh, cycle in and just give you a nice rise to your, your forces. You can see the Troll King was uh, keeping pretty well too. Um, this was the big fight here that just uh, sort of knocked him down a peg. And then, yeah, we just eliminated his forces. Uh, but most of his forces, as you can see by how high he was on the graph, uh, were the random spawns that were roaming around the map, the uh, death spores and things like that. So uh, as you can see, the demonologist, on the other hand, uh, we hit him once here, hit him again here, hit him again there, and then finished him off there. So we basically just kept knocking him down a peg by eliminating his armies. And we did it without really any, really any cost to us because of how many troops we got for free. It was pretty insane. So uh, the Kobold King was pretty easy to knock out because they didn't get any of the high level casters. And then troop for troop, the Kobolds just aren't a match for the, the Baron. Um, the Cloud Lord, again, same thing. Um, knocked him out pretty much. And then um, the Dryad Queen, we had to hunt down. But uh, she, I think, was also uh, affected by all those ants. Um, so that wasn't doing very good. The Mark Graph, we obviously eliminated fairly early because they started in that bad spot. And then the Troll King, of course, we talked about. So uh, in terms of Citadels, as you can see, we kept control. Gold, um, not as high as I thought, but it uh, obviously is pushing everybody else down. Um, but yeah, overall, uh, didn't have much in the way of concerns there. Big precipitous drop in iron when the spirits came. Lots and lots of spirits came. Um, didn't have I did have a drop I guess because of uh, that as well with the uh, spirits in gold production but they really went hard after my iron production so over here we had herb income let's see I'm trying to think is this also when I started selling it it could be that too uh, but herb income fungus sacrifices uh, hands of glory and gems and then trade we had all the trade so so yeah, overall, it was a pretty fun experience. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, stay tuned. I think the next one I was going to play is Druid by request, uh, which will be an interesting uh, change of pace for the Baron, for sure. And there's definitely some new things that the Druid gets their hands on that I'm looking forward to trying out, uh, especially the Primal Summons. So that should be a fun one. Um, so yeah, uh, stay tuned, and uh, I will catch you guys next time.